Good morning guys and welcome to Vlogmas week three. This is going to be the last week of Vlogmas. I cannot believe there is only a week left until Christmas. That is ridiculous. So, um, sorry if the vlog, last vlog, kind of ended, ended a bit abruptly. Um, I ended up getting really sick. There's been a sickness bug going around everywhere and I ended up getting really sick for the end part of the week um, and basically didn't do anything. So. I am finally starting to feel better now, thank God. That was awful. Um, <coughs> so now it's Saturday morning, it's approaching lunchtime now. I've had a bit of a lazy morning. I didn't mean to, but um, yeah, I've just kind of, my head's felt a bit foggy and I don't know, just not really been feeling well. So um, yeah, I need to edit last week's Vlogmas. I need to do the meal plan and the food shopping um, for the week. Um, and do a bit of housework. My room looks a state. Let me go and show you what my room looks like. Well, actually, it's not too bad. It's mostly my desk still, so my desk area looks like this. This just kind of needs to be sorted out. I've still got my advent calendar here with all of the bits just kind of laying around and the bits that I ordered from Feel Unique are just kind of sprawled across here. Um, so that all needs to be sorted out. Need to do some clothes washing. I am going to try and inject a few more Christmassy things. I need to write out my Christmas cards. I need to wrap my Christmas presents. Um, I feel like there's something else Christmassy I was going to do. I wanted to kind of do a drive around and look at Christmas lights, but Ben's not really here this weekend. He's been out a lot this week with it being Christmas, and he took his um, one of his clients out for dinner, and he was out for dinner last night. <clears throat> Sorry, excuse me. He was out for dinner last night with. Um, one of his kind of like subcontractors is friend, but he does the same thing, so they kind of help each other out. He's out tonight with um, one of his clients as well. They're having a like works party, which he's been invited to, so he's out there tonight. Tomorrow's his mum's birthday, but I think he's just going to pop in and drop off the present and card from us. Um, and that should be it. But I think it's going to get messy for him tonight, so I'm not sure what time he's going to be getting up tomorrow or what time he's going to be home. Um, and I need to do his business stuff as well this weekend so I feel really tired my arm is killing me I did a little bit of kind of like gentle yoga this morning um, just trying to ease back into the fitness Tone it up have um, come out with their New Year's challenge or kind of like announced it I guess um, so I'm not really in the mood to start thinking about fitness and stuff just yet um, but I'm trying to slowly get my health back on track and next year, the beginning of next year, I really want to focus on my health. So um, that's going to kind of come at the perfect time. So I kind of want to work on what I want my goals to be for that. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to waffle on for too much longer. It's been three minutes already and I don't want this to be a long vlog. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get on with some stuff. So it's about three o'clock in the afternoon now. I have been majorly procrastinating on doing the food shopping, but I finally sat down and started um, planning out the meals for next week when my dad showed up with all of these packages that have been delivered for me. So I thought I would open them, open them up and um, maybe show you guys some of the things that I have ordered recently. Firstly, I have a new bullet journal for next year. This is the Louis Term 1917, the dot grid, and I got the berry color. Um, that's maybe a little bit better colour wise. It's coming up more red than it is in real life, but um, yeah, I thought I would go for the berry colour for next year. Really excited about this because now I can start transferring over my collections and different things that I want to have in my new bullet journal for 2017. Next, I have nine wallets of photos from True Print. Um, I was ordering some pictures um, of the wedding for my nan because she wanted to send them to some extended family. And it was come, the price was so minimal that I thought, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and order all of our wedding pictures for us to have as well. Um, and then I can kind of figure out putting them in albums or in photo frames or whatever else. So yeah, I have nine wallets of photos here to go through, but I'm really pleased that we have actually got them printed now. I have the last of Ben's Christmas presents, which I need to get this wrapped up. It's a good thing he's not here today um, because he would know what this is without even looking at it. It's coffee and it just smells so amazing right now. As soon as I opened that package, I could smell it and knew instantly what it was. So is this going to... it might ruin it if I try and open it. So I think I'm just going to leave it wrapped. But basically, um, where is it from? It's from The Love of Coffee and it is a set of um what size are they 100 gram bags you get four and you get to pick the different flavors um so i've gone with um dark italian 
espresso blend, mocha java blend and a Brazilian blend. Um, Italian roast I know that he absolutely loves and the others are kind of what I think he'll like. So um, he has no idea, actually he has no idea about any of his presents this year, which I'm quite proud of myself for, because normally I have to ask him what he wants. Um, so yeah, I'm going to hopefully actually try and get this wrapped tonight, um, so that hopefully it will disguise the smell of it all. And now for the most exciting of the packages, the photo books that I was ordering, I think it was in week one of Vlogmas, um, have finally arrived and they look so good. So. Um, I have four of them and they're each a little bit different so we've got one for Ben's parents, one for my parents, one for my nan and one for Ben's granddad, all kind of personalised but some of the pictures are the same. So I thought I would give you a quick look through one of them. This one is Ben's mum and dad and by the time this video goes up everybody will have had their um, photo book so I'm not spoiling this for anybody. So obviously this is the front cover and then you open it up and it has this little page here before you get to the first page. And then there's me and Ben getting ready, some pictures of his family and friends kind of getting ready, helping us set up for the day, his dad helping to decorate the venue, me and Ben, my dress and shoes and our rings, signs that um, some of Ben's friends helped us make, and then my dad giving me away. And then kind of a few little details of the ceremony. Both of our families, so there's Ben's dad, his mum, Ben, me, and then my mum and my dad. And we did um, a sand ceremony, so basically you each have a different colour sand and you mix it together in one container and it kind of symbolises um, like the sand can't ever be separated out into its two different colours, the same as our lives will never be separated. And then a few pictures after the ceremony. Ben's family pictures. Big group shot down here. And then a few other little details of the wedding. A couple of fun pictures. I love this picture so much. And then um, my father-daughter dance, the mother-son dance, and then mine and Ben's first dance. And then the last page, and that's it. This is such good quality. I'm really pleased with how these have turned out. Um, this is a 20-page book, and it cost, I think it was £30, including delivery, I think. Um, but when I ordered these there was a discount code so I managed to get all of these for half price I believe which is fantastic um, but you can add extra pages I think it's like one pound something to add an additional um, two page spread so I think that was quite reasonable and you get to kind of design everything there's tons of different layouts to choose from this isn't sponsored by the way I just I was really impressed with um, the service and how quickly they've arrived and the quality and everything's fantastic and how much you can personalize it is great as well so really really pleased with these I need to get these wrapped up as well so that we can start handing them out to everybody before Christmas um, so yeah I'm gonna go back now to um, doing my food shopping because I really need to get that done today and then I might start wrapping some presents maybe, um, especially Ben's one. I need to get that wrapped up and hopefully disguised so he doesn't know what he's got.
Christmas Eve and me and Ben are heading into Norwich we're meeting a few of his friends to grab some brunch at number 33 and then we are going to be going ice skating I don't know how much I'm going to get vlog wise because um, there's a few people that are coming that I don't know um, so that'll probably feel a bit awkward and I don't know if I'll get anything of ice skating but that's what we're up to this morning and then I need to get home, edit this vlog together and get that uploading to go up tomorrow and then we will be packing and heading to Ben's mum or Ben's parents tonight um, and that's where we're going to be spending our Christmas Eve so I'll see what else I can get footage wise for you today. Hey guys, so it's the evening now. Um, we ended up not going to number 33. It was packed and we couldn't get in there. We couldn't get into, um, I can't remember what it's called, Harriet's tea room or something like that we ended up going to pandora's uh, which is okay but they were a bit slow bringing the food out and it wasn't the best experience um but anyway so we went there for brunch and then we went to ice skating in norwich that was really fun uh, had a really good time there managed to not fall over which is amazing because i am not a good skater i don't skate a lot at all so um yeah really pleased that I didn't fall over um and then we just went for a drink afterwards and then me and Ben went and had to um, pick up a couple of things in the city and then we've come home I've just been editing um this week's vlogmas and I'm pretty pleased with it so um we're just going to get ready and then head out and see some Christmas lights um which I'm going to film and that's going to be kind of the end part of this week's vlog um, but I just want to jump on here before the end of the vlog and just say thank you so much for watching. It's been really fun to do Vlogmas this year. Um, I think I mentioned at the beginning of Vlogmas that I've been wanting to do this for several years now and just never did it because I never felt like I had the time or that it would be very interesting. And maybe it hasn't been very interesting, but um, I've really enjoyed doing it. So I hope you have too. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you did. Comment below and let me know if you want me to do Vlogmas again next year um, or just more vlogs in general because I am thinking about maybe doing more vlogs next year as well. So I really hope you have enjoyed Vlogmas. I hope you have a fantastic Christmas and New Year. I'm going to be taking a little bit of time off now just to kind of relax and enjoy myself and spend time with family and friends. Um, but yeah, I hope you all have a lovely time and I will see you again very soon. Mm -hmm.